and welcome back to Virtually Fit. So, follow me, follow me. So we don't want to go some legs. We want to keep you on your legs, so we want to load your lower body. But now, we're going to go from a kneel to a partial squat, to a standing squat, to a pulsating squat, to a jump squat. So we're going to go with the team and go through the rotation. So Addie's going to show us the first part. So you go from kneel to your partial squat. Keep your hamstrings and your glutes loaded the whole time. Alternate which leg you start off with, but don't come all the way up. All right, follow me to the back. Ms. Leslie's going to show us. So she's going to do the same motion, but she's going to stand up at the end and squeeze and contract her glutes. So she's going to come up, squeeze, contract, and keep it controlled. All right, so follow me, follow me. Mr. Young Isaac right now. Same thing, but he's going to pulse. So the pulse is keeping the load on the quads and making sure that it doesn't get a break in between. So as you go back and forth, you get the offset, but this way you keep a direct load and get more time under tension. So Ms. Kendall is going to show us how to be an athlete. So she's going to go from her kneel to her position and explode up. So keep it controlled. Make sure when you explode, you explode from a low position, drive up, engage those glutes, and make sure you load back with those hip flexors. So stay explosive, stay controlled, and be safe, be smart. Pick the one that works for you, and be your best too. Now we're gonna do a walkout. So we wanna get that core engagement, we wanna make sure we keep that upper body under stress, but getting strong and keeping our full body moving. So we don't ever want you to get tired and get bored. So if you come over here, Ms. Leslie and Kendall are gonna show a walkout with a push-up. So all you're gonna do is walk out, get you a push-up, come all the way up. So make sure when you start, you wanna to try to get as close to your feet as possible, a controlled walkout. Make sure you stop with your hands underneath your shoulders, push up, and come back and stand all the way up. All right. So now we're gonna come over here and we're gonna show you what the walkout look like. So these young gentlemen, I'm gonna show you a walkout. You're gonna come down and just come back. So this way, if you're at the end of your workout, you wanna get some core engagement, you wanna get your body moving. Uh, moving, keep going. So we're gonna keep that heart rate up and keep time under time under tension, time under stress. So the more movement we get in a short amount of time, the better it is. So keep moving, keep your core tight. Don't go too low if your back bends. Now you're taking the, the stress off of your core. All right, try it and get to work. <laughs> 